towards right side. Oh, oh, oh my! Playing against the Golden State Warriors, he's got Kyrie, Porzingis, Tobias. So it's going to be a great matchup. So hope you guys are doing well, enjoying January so far. About two weeks into the new year. So let's get it. First play of the game, we're getting in the paint with Paul George. Nice contact layup. Porzingis pins in the paint. Nice pump fake. I fell for it. So I'm going to upload about three to four more games of the regular season and then I'm going to be jumping into the playoffs and as soon as, oh look at Kyrie with the perfect release, that was tough. As soon as I start the playoffs, hopefully we're going to be opening up season two and when season two opens up, we're going to have some open spots available so drop your PlayStation Networks. I mean, <laughs> your PlayStation IDs, because it says PSN, so I'm so used to saying PlayStation Network. But anyways, drop your PlayStation IDs, your gamer tag. This is PlayStation 5, by the way. Whenever the league opens up for Season 2, we're going to have a couple of open spots, so make sure your settings are not on private as well. Because a lot of people that message, their settings are on private. And I can't even end up messaging them, so they end up losing their spots. Kyrie Irving to the paint. Nice kick out. But like I said, make sure you're on public. You could receive messages so that when I'm going to message you, you could accept the invite. I can give you all the details. And I said it many, many times before. If you want to join the league, make sure you're a good sport. You can handle losing. You're going to be active. Because a lot of players joins the league and then they lose the first game and then they end up not playing anymore and they end up rage quitting the league or they end up crying. Because like I'm saying, online leagues is a grind. It's not like a quick rank game. It's not like a my player game. These games are 8 minutes each quarter. So it's almost 40 minutes each game. So you got to be able to grind it out. So yes, that's all I wanted to mention. Because... Online leagues, like I said, it's very tough. It's hard to score. You really got to take the time to practice with your team. Learn how to use them. As you can see right now with Paul George, I, I wasn't this good in the beginning of the season. Like this is only, I think, the sixth or I don't even know which game this is of the season. But if you remember watching my first games, I wasn't too good with this team. I didn't know the plays. I didn't know their tendencies. I didn't know their dribble moves. I didn't know their shot. So the more into the season you get into, the better you'll become. So in the beginning of the season, I lost a couple of games. But afterwards, it's been Gucci since. I've been winning a lot of games and heading into the playoffs. I think I am the number one seed in the East. So... <laughs> That's what I've been saying. Look at this ball movement. That was beautiful. I think that my team is playing like San Antonio in terms of their offense. I feel like Greg Popovich is controlling this team in terms of the plays. But I'm not using the Spurs playbook. I'm using something else. So the ball movement on our team is really beautiful. Chris Paul with a nice crossover pull-up. 
Man, this game is... Like, once you learn how to use your players and the tendencies and you learn your plays, the game can be much more fun. Because when you don't know what you're doing on offense, it can be really tough. Trust me. <laughs> Chris Ball, the step back three-point shot, pushes the lead to 15. But Kyrie gets in the paint and gets blocked by Jonathan Isaac, man. I've been saying this in my previous videos. I really love the defense of this team. You got Okogi off the bench, Mikhail Bridges off the bench. So you've always got defenders. Oladipo gets guarded really well by Okogi right there. So when I have Chris Paul and Paul George and Isaac that are tired, I got Jay Crowder as well off the bench. So they're really great defenders. Beautiful charge drawn by Okogi. Watch this move by Paul George. I switch directions. And I switch hands on my layup. So it's very important to switch directions, especially on the break. If not, you might bump into the defender. So if you've been watching a lot of my fast break clips or just my videos in general, my offense with Paul George and Chris Paul, I change directions a lot and I switch hands to avoid getting bumped. And Chris Paul, a nice floater, he avoids the block on the previous clip. So like I said as well, the floater is very dangerous, especially if you have a player with gold teardropper, such as Chris Paul. This is a great defensive clip by Paul George. It's really tough to stay in front of Kyrie, but PG did a nice job there. I got double teamed right here. Find Chris Paul. He misses the <laughs> he misses the layup, but this ends up to be a good possession. Watch this ball of movement. Step back. Another step back. Nice drive, and I get fouled. So I step back a lot, I go back and I retreat to the three-point line if I don't like what I see. Because a lot of times, I don't want to end up forcing it. Because if you do, in next gen, there's a lot of crazy animations. Like Oladipo just got one right there. So you gotta, you know, space it out. Make sure you know what you're doing. As you can see, I'm taking my time with PG. I'm waiting for the defense to react. He doubles. Nice find in the paint. So I always use the whole 24 seconds while well, I try to, unless there's something really wide open. So I try to use the whole 24 shot clock on my possessions. As you can see, the shot clock is almost at 10 and I didn't even shoot it yet. I'm still running a play. This is one of the best ball moving, <laughs> ball, ball movements that I've seen. Another view. <laughs> Man, I think that was my best offensive possession of this quarter. I think this one and the one in the second quarter where I, I moved the ball really well when I mentioned Greg Popovich, those were the two best plays. Paul George step back three. That was beautiful as well. That looked like real life Paul George. Oladipo gets in the paint, gets a nice dunk. So it's still a 13 point game. Actually, he missed it. <laughs> Yo, I thought he made that. But anyways, he missed it. It's still a 13 point game actually. It's a nice screen by Brogdon. Driving it into the paint. We're going to kick the ball out. Another nice ball movement possession. Paul George. Everybody touched the ball. <laughs> Oladipo is getting frustrated man. He's getting a lot of charges. We're playing great defense. I don't know. On next gen the charging is really really broken. Porzingis is trying to keep his squad in the game. Offense rebound put back. So the game is still within reach, only 13, and he still has Kyrie on the bench, resting up. So he's going to be going at me in the fourth quarter. Porzingis has his takeover to end the third. He's drawing Ving in the paint. I don't know how that's another charge, but we ended up getting one. So Chris Paul, the pump fake. I think I'm going to end up spinning right here. Spin move by CP3. Step back. <laughs> Yo, that was a nice move right there. That step back created space, and then I hesitated again. So last possession of the third quarter, Oladipo gets in the paints. Oh, that's Kyrie. My bad. <laughs> like I mentioned in my last video, my screen is very small. Sometimes I can't see the players. But Chris Paul with a nice floater over three defenders. Two guys try to block him. So this fourth quarter, I'm not going to lie, Chris Paul takes over. Look at these beautiful moves. Hesitation, get right by his defender. Beautiful <laughs> switching layup in the paint. Again, double screen for CP3. Nice pull up dribble to a mid range. Did you see how he moved, shuffled his feet before that mid range? That was beautiful. Chris Paul, the interception. Beautiful. I keep saying beautiful, but to be honest, a lot of these plays are really beautiful. <laughs> Yo, 
I can't even comment it anymore. These plays are crazy. If you play online leagues and you like ball movement, then I really liked this video that I'm making right now. Like these clips, I'm watching again, and I, I don't even realize how great the ball movement is until I'm actually watching it with you guys. Because when I'm playing in the game, I really don't pay attention to all of these thing, all of these things. So I feel like I'm doing an in-depth analysis of my own gameplay. So seeing my mistakes and seeing what I'm doing well is really nice to see. So Oladipo with the fast break dunk, he brings the lead down to 9, but there's only a minute 20 left. Like I said, I'm using the whole shot clock, there's only 10 seconds now, I'm spacing the floor. Watch how I'm taking my time, PG sizing up the defender, he went to the left side because he thought I was going to pass it for a 3. So like I said, I always wait for the defender to react, to take my time because you never know when they're going to make a mistake. Kyrie gets in the paint, gets blocked by PG-13, and that's game. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, man. A lot of um, things to take away from my, my clips that I put together for you guys. And um, if you want to see more, keep dropping likes and comments. I really appreciate all the feedback you guys have been giving me throughout these league videos. I really appreciate it. It means a lot. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe.